Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Natalie, and today we are watching Venom. Welcome back to my channel, everyone. Thank you so much for being here, especially you. Yes, you. Hello, you. Thank you to all of y'all who have continued to stick around and watch these videos with me. Y'all are the backbone of this channel. You guys make this community so amazing to be a part of, and I really appreciate your suggestions, and I love watching these movies and shows with you, so thank you so much for subscribing, and welcome if you're new. Hey, hi, how are ya? If you like what you see here and you enjoy these videos, maybe consider clicking that little red button below to subscribe. We definitely have a lot of fun over here, and I'd really appreciate it. Venom! I'm excited to get on into this one. <laughs> I have no expectations for this movie, really. I do know that Tom Hardy is in this movie, and I do like him. He kind of reminds me of Gary Oldman in the sense that he is very much a chameleon, and uh, I have a hard time placing him sometimes in movies, even more so than Gary Oldman. Uh, Tom Hardy, I have gone whole movies without knowing that it was him. Uh, so he definitely is a great actor, and I'm excited to see what he did in this movie. I think there's two Venom films, so we'll get to watch both of them here together on my channel. The only Venom I've ever met or seen is uh, the one portrayed by Topher Grace in the second Spider-Man movie. Or was that the third Spider-Man movie? I can't even remember at this point. It was the third Spider-Man movie, the third one. Right, that's the only Venom that I've met. It was pretty weird seeing Topher Grace as this villainous figure, honestly, because I just know him so much as Eric Foreman from that 70s show. But it was fun, and uh, I'm interested to see a different take on the character and a story focused around that character. I did notice a lot of folks in the live chat on my premiere for Spider-Man 3 saying over and over again, we are Venom, we are Venom. So I wonder if that's going to be a quote that I hear in this movie or the next Venom movie. I do plan on doing this video as a live premiere. I've been having fun doing the Spider-Man <laughs> videos as premieres over here on my channel. It's definitely a fun way to check in with y'all. If you happen to be catching this during the live premiere, hi! How's it going? I, I have a lot of fun doing these premieres and uh, I hope you guys enjoy them as well. I'm really interested to see what this movie has in store because the very little that I know about Venom, he seems like a villain overtaken by a parasite. So I'm wondering if this will really be a superhero movie or a super villain kind of movie, you know, like a villainous arc. Um, we have had villain type movies done in the past. And one movie that I did end up seeing, actually one of the few movies that I've actually seen in theaters was The Joker. It came out maybe about a year before I started really seriously doing videos here on YouTube, or maybe it was even less time than that. It might've been like six months or something. But I did see that movie in theaters. And uh, you know, every once in a while we'll get a movie where we focus around a villain and their rise or demise rather. Um, into becoming who they are. And I'm definitely curious to see what Venom's story is. I always empathize with a, uh, a very complex antagonist, so I'm hoping that his story is empathetic and interesting and really ropes me in because I, I love that kind of stuff. And with all that being said, guys, I think we should hop on into this one and see what this movie is all about. <laughs> so if you guys are ready, grab a drink, grab a snack, and let's get into the movie. Oh, sorry, <laughs> sorry. I just wanted to recline a little bit, you know? Oh, are we gonna see the, the parasite thing fall in that meteor from the sky? Is that why we're starting in space? The specimens are secured and we're heading- Oh, I bet the specimens aren't secured. Oh, shit. what's going wrong? It's like alien. The specimens are not secure. Oh, they're gonna die, so sad. They, oh, they landed in Malaysia, interesting. This really is like the start to like an alien sci-fi horror movie. Oh, there are the specimens. Uh-oh. One of the astronauts is still alive. Oh, I bet the, the specimen attached itself to him like a host. So Jenny Slate is in this movie? I, th I think that was her. I'm pretty sure it was her. I love Jenny Slate. I almost ended up on a plane with her and I was geeking the f*** out. Uh-oh. Oh, that was creepy as f***. Oh, it's very efficient. Oh, it's take- now it's this Okay, changing, they're changing forms. Ew, is it healing itself? Holy f that's nasty. Fun. It's really a lot like Alien or even The Thing. San Fran. Oh, wow, you were in a suit? Yes. Oh, is she a lawyer? This woman he's with seems to really have her together. 
and he seems to not. <laughs> and please do not forget your helmet. Helmet? Well, I'm glad that you like it because I plan on wearing it at our wedding. That's hot. Oh, they're getting married? All right, he probably has his together. He's probably just a little different. He looks like a bad boy and she looks like a good girl because she's like the lawyer in the suit. Oh, is he a journalist? Okay, I take it back. He's got his together. He's just got like a degenerate kind of look to him. He's like a hardcore, badass journalist. I got you the big one exclusive. Yahoo. Carlton Drake. He wants to talk about his rockets. Assure everyone that's safe that the crash was an anomaly. Oh, yeah, isn't this kind of gonna go like against what his wife is doing? I, I can't, you know, and not do my job. The guy you work for is a complete. I don't work for Drake. I work for my firm and my firm. Oh, oh, it's, oh. So she's defending the guy that he has to interview. I get it. Maybe you were run out of New York. I don't want you run out of San Francisco. Oh no, he was run out of New York. Gotta be tough to be run out of New York, I feel like. Oh, is he gonna look at that? Oh no, you can't, no. No, that's like a betrayal of her trust. Even the kitty knows this is wrong. That's really not good, man. You're not supposed to be allowed to look at this. You recruit the most vulnerable of us to volunteer for tests mm. that more often than not end up killing people. I'm, I'm aware of these rumors online. There's a lot of fake news out there. These right. Fake news. Yeah, the, the actual legal case is like Sarah Chambers. Oh no. Was this a live broadcast that he was doing? We're not finished. Yes, you are, Mr. Brock. Is that a threat? Have a nice life. Wow, probably is a threat. And also you probably just got your fiance in so much trouble because they're gonna connect that they're dating. Excuse me? Who's your source? Eddie? Exactly. You didn't think this was gonna come back on her? You know, for a smart guy, you really are a dumbass. Exactly, man, he is. You're fired, Eddie. <laughs> Why do people in movies always choose to look out the window when they say you're fired? He just turns away. You're fired. <laughs> what you did got me fired. <gasps> you used me. Oh, I mean, honestly, if like my partner did that to me, I would do the same thing because it's not about the fact that she got fired. It's about the fact that like he betrayed her trust and went behind her back and used her and didn't consider the implications of what could go wrong for her. Oh, she has to walk like a zombie. Is that the thing she has to? Oh, they like the eels, huh? Hey, come on up. That poor man. That poor man was just asking to be paid. Oh guys, you really should all run away. Holy f Oh no, no, not the old lady, leave her alone. Wait, oh, why does she wanna look like her? Interesting. Oh my God, this is really horrifying. It is like the thing, it can just transform so fast. Six months later, oh. Oh God, my shoulders are so tense. Begin human trials. Oh, it's way too soon to even begin to think Dr. about Scott something. Like, I understand, but think it's an ethical question. Think of your kids. Was that a threat when he was saying, think of your kids, like he was threatening her? This guy is a Why do people always want to start human trials immediately the second something kind of works on an animal? They're just always so reckless. You give me a dollar for a song, I'll throw in the paper. I tell you what, I will give you 20 bucks, but not to sing, all right? <laughs> Don't sing for me though. <laughs> How are you doing, Eddie? Ah, uh, aches and pains, you know, aches and pains. You look like sh Ah, <laughs> she tells it like it is. You look like sh <laughs> She repeated herself. <laughs> I love when you say excuse me and people just double down on what they said. Does this guy, he doesn't know what, oh no, he has no idea what is being done to him. We're just putting this unwilling subject in there. He's like one of those psychotic people who just views every person around him as someone to be used. It's like his little play things. This time, I will not abandon us. He's manipulating you. It's like so obvious. Yeah, because no one would ever willingly sign up for this. Bring in the next volunteer. Yeah, Jenny Slate's starting to realize that the guy she works for is f***ed up. Yeah, yeah, honey, he's f***ed up. You have to know how to disappear. I was pretty good, but you know, you, uh, whoever you are, you suck. Oh, Jenny Slate. That's funny. He's got a lab filled with poor people and they're all signing waivers that they don't understand. And he's using them like guinea pigs and they are dying. Come on, Eddie, you could have your redemption arc as a journalist. You need to find yourself another white knight in skirt because I am done, I am done. You, why? You have nothing else to lose, come on. No, you're not. Oh, the kitty. Is this her apartment? Does she still live in the same place? Eddie? Oh, was she on a date? She was on a date. Dan, this is Eddie. Yeah. It's only been six months. Although, why wait, you know? So I'll see you inside. Oh, 
not only is she dating, they're close enough in a relationship that like they're in the same place together. She's kissing him in front of him. It's been six months, it's so fast. Are we, are we gonna try and find our way back? No, we can't. You lost your trust, dude. You did this, Eddie. Yeah, you did. Not Carlson Drake, not the network, you. She's right, I don't blame her at all. It was all him. Is he gonna drop the ring in the, in the bay? Bro, I think you're a little hard on money. You should probably sell that. Okay, good, 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 good. Oh, just living life on the edge there, hanging it over the bay. Oh, he's doing it again. Put it in your pocket, thank you. Drake believes that the union between human and symbiote is the key to our survival, but not here on Earth. I worry that somebody's gonna get her in trouble by seeing this guy on the cameras. He's just feeding them in if the match is exact. They die. Uh-oh. You know what they say. Science never sleeps. <laughs> She's so cute. Oh God, what if like a symbiote finds him right now? Oh no, no, don't go in there. Oh, he's taking photos. Smart. I forgot he's doing research. <laughs> oh no, he set off an alarm. Why is she freaking out like that? Did they... What the f What do they do to her? No, did they already experiment on her? Oh no, oh no. He was trying to help her. Is she gonna be dead after this? I'm sure it's a perfect match for him. He's gonna be fine, but Maria, oh God. Of course, he's got powers now, yeah. I just hope that Jenny Slate's character doesn't get in trouble. Oh my God. The irony that the only host that's successfully taken on this symbiote is the journalist who wants to take Drake down. The other symbiote doesn't seem to have a problem attaching onto any host, you know? The one that's in like Malaysia. It's controlling his body. Wow. Whoa. He's not feeling so good, huh? Is he eating frozen food? Like not even cooked, frozen tater tots? The host is hung. Oh no! Oh, that toilet needs to be cleaned, Eddie. Eddie, clean your bathroom, man. That's disgusting. <laughs> oh my God, it talks to him? Oh, this is amazing. Oh my God. Oh, there's the other one. Oh, it's boarding a flight to San Francisco. What a kawinky dink. It's gonna figure out how to fly. Oh no, it's gonna take the, the little girl and then it'll be with a parent and then it, oh no. Not the little girl. This thing is too smart. Oh no. Food. Ah! Who said that? Oh my God, he's gonna have this thing where he talks to himself now. That's so funny. Is he gonna wanna eat a raw lobster? Please no, please no. Oh my God, Eddie, what are you doing here? This is dead. Oh, it needs to, he needs to eat living food. Snap out of it! Uh, no. Ah! <laughs> Considering him as a food source? Eddie, you're gonna get arrested, bro. Now I'm gonna call the police. No, no, please don't call the police. Okay, call an ambulance. I'm a doctor. This man is my um patient. Uh -huh. That guy's so nice. Dan is so nice. Thank you, Dan. MVP right here. Hey, Eddie. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Dan. <laughs> hey, man, you want to get out of here <laughs> and maybe go to a hospital? <laughs> hey, what's happening in there? Why does it hurt him? It hurts the host. The host doesn't like MRI scans. Listen, you're not the first person to freak out in there. I get claustrophobic too. Uh, it was more than that. Dan is so nice. And he's whining and complaining like an old baby again. Oh. This little dog. Oh, the dog doesn't like him because the dog knows. The dog sees the host. Oh, it doesn't like high-pitched sound. Oh, that's why the MRI harmed him. I get it. Hungry. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> that thing is always hungry. It's really inconvenient. It is so inconvenient as somebody who doesn't make a lot of money to have to feed that thing. It wants living animals. You have to go hunt. <laughs> You have a parasite. Oh, he does actually. Um, we are gonna get you on some meds and we are gonna clear that out. Uh-huh. Never gonna happen. Never gonna happen. <laughs> oh, I really like want Dan and Anne to stay together. Dan and Anne, that's so cute. They're actually really cute together. He's a really cute, he's a nice guy. I was troubled by what we've been doing. He's gonna threaten her. 
Oh no, I'm worried for her. But I need you to tell me who was here with you. I can't do that. Oh wow, uh oh. The person who was here, because they're gonna die, they're in grave danger. Actually, he's not gonna die from the host thing. He's doing just fine, all things considered. She's gonna tell I him. I promise, from here on in, we will do things differently. That's a lie, it's a lie. He's just a smooth talker. Eddie Brock. Uh oh, uh oh, you're in trouble. Oh no, I think he's gonna snap. You are our best. Open it. No f way. That is so savage and illegal. I thought he might do that, but I was like, no, that's too crazy. What the f That is so f illegal and horrible. Do not open that door. Venom told you not to open it, Eddie. What are you doing? I'm, uh, I'm putting my hands up. <laughs> you are making us look bad. <laughs> Oh no. Oh, you guys are dead. You're done. I'm so sorry about your friends. Ah! I'm so sorry about your friends. Oh, bye. Oh. Oh my gosh. These things are just superior fighting beings. Outstanding. Now, let's bite all the heads off and pile them up in the corner. No. No. We don't do that, Venom. No. <laughs> I like how this, he, he seems, Eddie seems more resilient to uh, withstanding everything Venom wants him to do. What the hell? Dude, how did you do that? Apparently, I have a parasite. <laughs> I love how that guy was like, how did you do that? In reality, I would just be like, what the f man? Get out of my living room. Are you seeing this? He's achieved symbiosis. Oh, Jesus. Oh, no. Ugh. I wonder what happened to Jenny Slate's character. I wonder if she achieves symbiosis or if she just dies. It's so illegal. Like, you can't just kill. I mean, all the people he's killing are horrible. But, but like, don't you think her family is going to ask questions? He just, he needs a reality check, this Drake guy. Do not let him get away. Do you... Oh, we're going to let him get away? Yeah, that's a threat to Therese. He really loves to threaten people. And I, I don't like this guy. He's awful. I just can't wait for him to die, honestly. Duck! It is so perceptive. It's like all seeing and all knowing. Thank you. You are welcome. Look at this beautiful friendship. Do not let him get away. I've got him. Thank you for your input, asshole. He's trying. <laughs> you repeating do not let him get away is not helping. No, 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 no. Oh no, not over the hill. Not over the hill. Not this street. <laughs> is he going to connect to the bike again? Oh, yep, there we go. Great. Wow, he can ride his motorbike better than ever before. He's like a daredevil now. This is great. The car just followed him. Like the cars just, they're just tearing apart San Francisco. They don't even care. You guys should be dead. Just doing a high speed car chase in San Francisco. Wow, they've done a really good job at chasing him. I will admit. Ow! Oh no! <laughs> Should have been looking where you were going. Oh, ew! Oh, it's healing him. Oh, the broken bones. Oh no! Oh no! He's he's ripping people's heads off. These creatures are really very hungry, huh? They love to eat living things. Oh, it swims very fast. Oh my god, yes, they can have a face-to-face -face conversation, holy I sh am Venom. Venom, is that the name you like to go by, really? I am inside your head. Oh, that's fun. You are a ah. loser. <laughs> you are a loser. <laughs> are, you gonna, are you gonna eat anybody else? Most likely. That is why we are here. What? To eat everyone? That is why we are here, to, to eat people? You wanna come here and feed? You wanna go get the rocket, go back, get all the other, your friends maybe from the planet, your other symbiotes and infest the planet? Is that the goal here? This is so crazy. I didn't realize that the creature would actually be calling itself Venom. It's worse than I thought. His systems, renal, endocrine, they're behaving abnormally. I've never seen anything like well, it. Well, what does that mean? He's dying slowly. Everything's failing. So he's not even taking the symbiote that well. He's just taking it better than everybody else did. Oh, Dora. This is the higher life form. You stood by and watched while he died. Oh, it died. Oh, you guys are going to get threatened. Yep. The higher life form. Yeah. And he doesn't even care about showing them that he killed Dora. Like they're all just fine with it. I don't want to see you again. 
unless you have Brock. Dude, I feel like any minute now, all these people are just, he's not being careful at all. I feel like he would be arrested so quick at this point because everybody would turn on him. This is just so crazy that he's doing. It is peaceful up here. I'm not very good with heights. <laughs> it's so funny that they keep switching perspective of being inside the, each other's heads. You are far too good of a match to throw away so soon. Ah. Plus, I am starting to like you. <laughs> you I am not so different. Aw, they're becoming friends. This is so cute. It's like a bromance. It just caught the, f the gigantic bullet thing, whatever that was. It's like, oh, smoke. The get. Oh my God, it's literally catching them. Oh no, now it's a horror movie. Oh no. Oh, he's totally like a villain, but I kind of love this. It's really fun. Why is she here? She just tra- Really? Anne, you you seriously tracked him here? How did she hear he was here? Eddie! Eddie, oh, wait! What, what, what the hell is That's that? That's not me! At least she saw it, so she doesn't think he's just losing his mind anymore. Hospital! Right now. Uh-huh. I don't think it's gonna work. After what she- I like her. I like her, get in. Oh. After what she just saw, she's still willing to drive him. That's, she's a badass bitch, man. Dan just needs to do another MRI. No MRI. No MRI. <laughs> Sound that four to 6,000 hertz is lethal. Oh, it knows exactly the level of its weakness. You never apologized. Oh, look, it knows. See, it knows. I am truly sorry for whatever I, and everything I have ever done to you. Now's really not the time. Let's just keep you alive, okay? Oh, that's nice. <laughs> okay, Drake. It's your chance to get f***ed up, man. What, did all your workers leave you? Because you're a jerk and also incredibly psychotic. Oh, the, li the little kid found him because the little kid knows they need the rocket because it's not a little kid. You're killing him. They do not know what they are talking about. Oh my God. <gasps> hey, don't hurt Dan. Stop, Venom, stop. No, don't do that. Oh, smart girl, smart girl. Oh, it's, it needs oxygen or it's not gonna be okay very, very, very soon. What happened to we? Man, what happened to we? Oh, they became friends already. We're done. We're done. I, I bet you're not, Eddie. Oh, it's gonna get out, it's gonna break free. I want to break free. I want to break free, bye-bye. Oh no, not the dog. No, the dog. You really shouldn't have brought your dog to the hospital. Not the dog. That makes me really sad, man. Oh, it's not in him anymore. Oh, that's so funny. They're gonna take him and he's not even, he doesn't even have the, the symbiote anymore. The dog is watching! It is really cute. Okay, well now I'm happy that we can at least watch the dog run around. Cause that's kind of cute. I love how Venom doesn't mind like letting her in on it. It's like, hey, hey, what's up? I'll glow my eyes at you. Oh, right, he has a symbiote, doesn't he? What's insane is the way humans choose to live today. Stop giving your stupid speeches, man. Nobody cares. We've brought the planet to the brink of extinction. That's true, okay, but it doesn't mean that you get to use people. I have no idea. Where is he? Oh. Ooh, fun. Oh, he has one up his ass, too. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> You're just like a, they're gonna walk it and shoot him. This is so crazy. This is a horrible company. <laughs> you guys need to be taken down. I don't believe in gun. You should. Oh, it looks like a woman now. Wait, uh, is it, is it, is it Anne? No way is it Anne. What? No way. Oh my God. Oh my God. And she's fine. She didn't die from the, the experience. That's great. We have got to go. We got to go where? Where are we going? Well, I'm <laughs> coming with you. No, it's going to get ugly. Yeah, I can fight ugly. <laughs> Not today. I like how Venom's protecting her. They're both like, she she can fight ugly and Venom's like, no, <laughs> I like her. We protect her. <laughs> it's so cute. But it is different now, Eddie. Why? I have decided to stay. <gasps> he likes it here. On my planet, I am kind of a loser. Oh. But here, we could be more. <laughs> On my planet, I am kind of a loser, like you. I don't really know exactly what changed Venom's mind that Eddie did, but okay. Auto sequence has been Oh my God. Oh, how to abort the rocket. He's reading on it. Uh-oh. Oh no, is he sensing it? Oh no. Wow, yep. You've taken it one step too far, Drake. You've gone to the point of no return. How come that thing can just be all the weapons? That is crazy. You have a strong host. Uh-huh. Yeah, I bet his host is probably stronger than Drake, but oh God. Oh, oh no. Oh God! Drake, stop! Oh 
no. Oh, no. He managed to pull it from him. That's crazy. Nice. Good job, Eddie. Oh, I like Venom, too. Come on. Oh, this is so trippy. The artwork. Oh, my God. This is crazy. It absorbed both of them. Oh, no. It can do that? That doesn't seem fair. That doesn't seem fair. Yes. Wait, is it? What's her name? Is it uh, Anne? She really is so smart. Oh, yes. She put it on the speakers. You are a genius. I told you I could fight ugly. Yeah, good job, girl. I just feel bad because you're these men are on top of a building right now. Oh, ow. Oh, really, Drake? Drake, you are so dumb, man. Yeah! Beat his ass, man! You're too late. Oh no. This is the next stage of You talk too much. Yeah, you do! You do, Eddie. I mean or Drake, you're right, Eddie. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Venom, where's Venom? Come on, Venom, hurry up. I thought they separated. Oh, there he is. He's right there. 10 seconds. We don't have enough time to stop this rocket. What are we gonna do? Oh, we're gonna use the weapon he gave us, huh? What are we doing? Well, oh my God. Have a nice life. Nice, there you go. Have a nice life. Oh, Drake. Oh, how did he, I guess he grabbed Drake down there when he hit the water, I see, okay. I was wondering how Riot was still okay. Oh no! Goodbye, Eddie. What? No! What? Venom! It saved him? Yeah, isn't that what Drake said to Eddie when he, didn't he say have a nice life? Yeah, he did. Oh, that's fun. That's a fun little repeat of the line. Oh my God, Venom just went out like that? But I was attached. And there's a second movie. <laughs> Wow, I was not expecting Venom to die. Hey, I'm sorry about Venom. Oh, she she feels bad. It's like he lost he lost a loved one. <laughs> We're not gonna tell Dan about this. Oh. Okay? Look at her. She has no idea we are going to get her back. Hey, don't give up on her. Stan. Either of you. Either of you. <laughs> Who's that guy? Okay. <laughs> this thing looks delicious. No, don't eat the dog. He's fine. He didn't die. The payments do, Chan. Oh, you can eat him. You can eat him. Bad guy, right? Yep. I like that he's asking. Bad guy, right? Bad guy? You come in here again, and we will find you and eat both your arms and then both of your legs. So you will be this armless, legless, faceless thing, won't you? Rolling down the street like a turd in the wind. <laughs> we... Ah, Venom. We are Venom! Ah! Uh... Oh my god. Oh my god, Mrs. Chen is gonna be horrified. Eddie? What was that? She's like, <laughs> oh my god, that was so funny. That was so fun! Oh, there's an end, there's a mid credit. San Quentin, who's in prison? Is this Tom Hardy on his motorbike going to visit the prison? Oh, he's going to interview. It's his interview. <gasps> I wonder who he's gonna interview. It's gotta be someone a part of the Spider Man world, right? Red. He's writing in blood. Welcome, Eddie. That's fun. That's so fun. Hi, Eddie. Oh my God. Tough to see you in this light, Eddie. Oh no, don't step closer. That's what Hannibal wants. <laughs> oh my God, I can't believe he's in this movie. When I get out of here, and I will, there's gonna be carnage. Oh, funny. That's the name of uh, the next movie. It's Venom, Let There Be Carnage. I can't believe Woody Harrelson was in this movie. Wow. And with a wig like that. <laughs> How interesting. This was a fun movie. I uh, was curious to see which direction it was gonna be taken in. Like if Venom was kind of solely gonna be this villainous thing or if it was gonna be endearing at all. And it, it was definitely more endearing than I expected. I didn't really realize that it was gonna call itself Venom. Like that was its name. I thought that was gonna come from something else, but it was fun. It was cute, really funny. Uh, I think all the actors did a good job, but especially Tom Hardy and Michelle Williams. Definitely curious to see Woody Harrelson in the last little scene there, the mid credit scene. I was not uh, expecting him to be in that red wig. <laughs> so that'll be interesting to see him in the next movie because I know the next one's called Let There Be Carnage. Yeah, just funny, man. Just a fun movie. I don't really have that much to say. It was just really enjoyable and entertaining. It was like cute watching these two characters like this parasite and this person kind of fall in love with each other like become best friends <laughs> it was really adorable <laughs> i'm happy i understand where we are venom comes from now that was a fun moment and uh 
Yeah, it was just a fun movie. I don't really have too much to say, but I really enjoyed it and I had a good time while watching this. I think I'm going to keep this outro pretty short and sweet because I'm just kind of left speechless and I, I don't really have much to comment on, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, please give it a thumbs up because it helps me out and it also lets me know that you guys want to see more content like this. Of course, let me know your thoughts in the comments down below and anything else you might like me to watch next and subscribe if you want to. Till the next one, stay golden. Bye.